And what is your belief, your core belief as a Christian? What do you mean my core belief? Can you elaborate on me? Yeah, like what is the main belief where if you don't believe in that, you're not a Christian anymore? Well, I believe that Jesus died on the cross. He rose on the third day, forgave okay. my sins, and I'm going to heaven for it. Right. How do you know you're going to heaven? How do I know that I'm going to heaven? Because of my Bible says so. I believe every word that's in the Bible. Where does it say in the Bible you're going to heaven? It says if I deny myself and follow, follow uh, if I deny myself, pick up my cross and follow him, and deny my flesh, and follow the ways of Jesus, I'm going to heaven. Yeah, well, where does it say that you're doing all this and that you're going to heaven? I haven't seen you. I haven't seen you pick up a cross or follow Jesus Christ. Okay. For example, Jesus Christ. Do you know he worshipped one God, a Unitarian God? He, he, he worshipped the Father. Yes. Yeah. Do yes. you worship only the Father? I worship the, the, the God is the uh, God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy there Spirit. There you go. You see, you have already contradicted Jesus okay. at the first go. Okay. So how do you? How can I, I believe that you're following Jesus yes. when you are clearly contradicting what Jesus follows? How am I contradicting? Because yourself? Jesus only worshipped and prayed to the Father. Okay. You, on the other hand, my friend, okay. are worshipping the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Okay. Whom do I believe? You or Jesus? Us as Christians, we believe that we're three parts, right? We believe that we're the body, the soul, and the spirit. That's what we believe as Christians. How many persons are you? Let me finish. Yeah. Um, we believe we're I'm one person, three parts. Thank you. L yeah. Let me explain. Yeah, I'm, I'm, don't, I'm, don't I'm listening. Yeah. Parts, just let me explain. I'm listening. So we Go believe on. that. Yeah. God is also three parts. When He said, "Let us create us in yeah. our likeness, our wholeness, and our image," yeah. He was speaking about the spiritual principles of being three parts. Just like yourself, sir. You understand as you stand in front of me, you're a body and a soul, right? You you agree with me there, right? Oh yeah. I've got okay. a body and soul, yeah. Okay. You can see yourself as one part, and everyone else can yeah. see you. Here one as person, one part. yeah. All right. So why don't you understand the principle of the Trinity? Because the Trinity is three persons, not one person. All right, but you understand that you can see yourself as one part, but you are two parts. Right? No, no, not parts. I'm I'm one person. Yeah. I'm having the material nature and immaterial nature. But that's two. Well, you 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 need to let me speak as well. Okay, no problem. Okay. So let this be a friendly discussion. It's friendly, man. Okay, I love good. It, bro. My question to you was with yes. regards to the worship and prayer. Okay. You, my friend, have clearly stated that you pray and worship the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Am I right? Okay, yes. So tell me if I'm misrepresenting you. I, I okay. worship God, yes. That's Was it. Jesus... Wait, wait. When you say God, you mean yes. Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit? Yes. Okay. Did Jesus know God? Did Jesus know God? Yes. He did indeed. Good. Did he know God better than you and me? Of course. Of course. I agree as well. Yeah. Okay. Did Jesus pray and worship to the Trinity or a Unitarian God? He worshipped to the Father, yes, because he had the Spirit inside of him. So it means only one person, right? Okay. Uh, okay. Yeah, okay. Have you not ever already seen the contradiction in your belief okay. and that of Jesus right, Christ? Let me ask you a question. No, no, don't right. ask me a question. Answer my question. Can I, Why, can I say what? Say how, can you, how can you contradict the teaching of Jesus? Because Jesus said, if you love me, you will follow and obey my teaching and my commandments. Okay, yes? Exactly, yeah. Is that right? Yes. Do you love Jesus? Absolutely. So why don't you follow the commandments and teaching of Jesus? How do you know I don't, sir? Because you, you just claim that you actually follow, uh, so, sorry, you worship and pray to the Trinity. Yes. Jesus never did that. God. God, the Godhead. Yeah, but the Godhead, Jesus... Because wait, Jesus wait. had the Spirit There's a difference between and he worshipped the Father. So all of them work in one accord. No, no, no. Jesus was himself telling people to pray only to the Father. Am I right? Ask me the question again. Okay, my question is this. Yes. When Jesus was asked how to pray and whom yes. to pray to, what did he teach? What did he to teach the, the to people? The Father. Exactly. Yes. Only the Father, right? Yes. Whom do you pray to? I pray to the God. God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. Do you not see the contradiction yet? No, I don't see the contradiction. Do you guys see the contradiction? You, but what, what okay. it is, is that's so everyone here sees the contradiction except yourself. Just because if there was a hundred people stood in front of me that see the contradiction, I would still stand strong in my So opinion. even if Jesus so came here and something. he tells you that only pray to the Father, even then you'll say, no, I pray to the Trinity. Jesus so you don't even believe Jesus Christ? But Jesus already did. He, wouldn't say that. he already now, did now, in the no, Bible. Sorry, I apologize. Okay. Jesus himself, when he was asked the question, how shall we pray? He says, hallow be thy name. Okay. Yes. Similarly, or glory to the Father. Okay. Yes. He did not say, hallow be thy name, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. He said, only the Father. 